Hahaha! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, everyone. It's your boy, Asalamani. Not back with another reaction video, but today, long-awaited 1,000 subscribers special. I told you I was gonna do a whisper challenge and a Q&A. How this is gonna work is I'm gonna be doing a Q&A after. I'm gonna do the whisper challenge first, and I want to introduce you to someone. Absolutely retarded. <laughs> I don't know how we're related. My ugly sister. <laughs> no, don't, don't get too close. I never had I did it got nobody with me said it. So we're gonna be doing the whisper challenge. The way this works is she's written down three sentences or phrases or whatever the hell the hell you wanna call it. Maybe paragraphs for her because she's a bit retarded. <laughs> I've written down three sentences and we have to guess each other what we're saying and then I'm going to be doing a Q&A after by myself. So this is the whisper challenge. Of course, the song we're going to be playing or who goes first? Scissors, paper, rock. 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 <laughs> so I'm putting the headphones on. I'm going first. She has a question. I asked her what's the... <laughs> I was like, write, write a question or a sentence. I was like, don't do too many words. I was like, how many words is that? She's like, not much. I don't know how many. She's like, eight. I was like, oh, Jesus Christ. So good luck to me. I have to guess eight words. It's going to be so bad. <laughs> and of course, who are we listening to? Lejare. Oh my God. Loving this song. I might do a reaction on this. So this. Waste of chat. Let's go. Lejare. Are you oh my, ready? This is really so bad. Are you ready? <laughs> it's so <hard. laughs> okay. okay, wait, hold on. Um, huh? yeah, yeah. What did I do? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I have to get into this. Okay. My dog. My shoe. <laughs> What the hell did you say? My dog. My god. <laughs> my dog. Master. Oh my god. And you have eight words. <laughs> <laughs> my dog. My god. <laughs> my dog. My slow. <laughs> <laughs> My toe. <laughs> okay, my, my dog. <laughs> I know it's I do. What is this? My dog can do cool tricks. Holy cancer. Forwards. Forwards? What? Day. Is? Day. Can. Day. Day. Ten. What day? What can? What day is it? What am I? <laughs> <laughs> what day? <laughs> the, the day. <laughs> what day? <laughs> what gay? <laughs> what? I can hear you. Can what? Hear you. <laughs> can you hear me? What? What? Day? Day? Wait. Day? 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 Yeah. Yeah. What is day? Is it. What day is it? Yes. Yeah. See? See? <laughs> See, that was easy. Yes. You know, what is the boy doing when he walks down the street and he looks left and then what he does is this really good thing. <laughs> okay, your turn. Okay. I. Oh my I. Gosh. I. House. Am. Have have the the best bus best best sister. <laughs> I have the best brother. She wants to say how nice. I have the best brother. <laughs> what a rat! <laughs> All right, game over. <laughs> game over. How how old old are are you you? Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, there you are. Last one for you. This is her last one. I. I. Am. Am. Very. 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 Ugly. Ugly. <laughs> I am very sexy, not ugly. Is that I'm very ugly? Yeah. I am very ugly. I got a tutu. Tutu. So guys, let me know in the comment section below what challenge I should do next. And if you want to see more challenge videos, let me know. So I hope you guys enjoyed. This is the last question. Let's see who wins. I just realized we done the same third question. I said you are ugly. She said it to me as well. What the heck? Okay. <laughs> what? You realize after? Okay. Okay. You are ugly. You are ugly. You are ugly? Yeah. <laughs> we did the same one. Look, we did the same question. We did the same question. <laughs> Except she said I am ugly and I said you are ugly, so it went back to me. <laughs> what the hell? Is that the same one? Seems like this is how you know we're related. We're we ugly or related, but we're somehow related. I guess there's something, some chromosome that's the same. <laughs> so guys, that was the whisper challenge with my sister. She has to go sleep now, so I'm gonna do the QA by myself. And guys, if you want to see more challenge videos, let me know. If you like this challenge video, leave a like below. Comment below what we should do next, and if you think that I am the winner, let me know. Jokes, I'm the winner. <laughs> she won three two. She won three two. But you know, I was being nice because I'm the older brother. I was like, oh poor girl. You know, let's just let her win. Uh, okay. <laughs> like, leave a like. If you're new, subscribe to the channel. Comment below what comment we should who's react the to. Sibling. No, no, don't comment. <laughs> yeah. Oh, actually, comment. I'm probably gonna win anyway. No, I'm gonna win. <laughs> All right, guys. This is her going, and now I'm gonna do a and A challenge. What? So guys, I hope you enjoyed the challenge video. Now it's time for Q&A time. This is from Instagram and YouTube combined. Whole bunch of questions here. I've got about eight pages of just questions. So I'm gonna try filter. I'm gonna try and answer as many as I can. Like I always say, grab your popcorn, boom. Grab your drink. And it's question and answer time. So, first question. Where were you born? I was born in Australia, in Sydney specifically, and also more specific, I was born in a place called Canterbury. So that's the reason why I go for Bulldogs. Anyone from Sydney that you know, I was born in Canterbury, so that's southwest of Sydney. Say one line, answer honestly. Are you really a virgin? Next question! <laughs> Even I don't know this answer, so. <laughs> Are you married or committed? No, I am not married or committed. I am single like a Pringle, looking like a little bit of a tingle. Nothing to ask, just want to say lots of love from Bangladesh. May Allah give you all, ha all the happiness. Thank you so much. Thanks for the support from Bangladesh. I love you guys. India, Pakistan, anyone. Your beard is awesome. Do you sp apply anything special? No, I do not apply anything special. I feel like beard comes out to genetics because my brother actually, my brother and my brothers, they have a little bit less thickness in the beard compared to mine, so it just comes down. It's just, I think some people get it, some people don't. Vegan or non-vegetarian? I am non-vegetarian, unfortunately. I'm not unfortunately, but I'm non-vegetarian. I actually eat meat, so that's that. Why are you so cute? I'm kind of crushing on you. You kind of converted my preference. <laughs> okay, okay. How'd you get those interpersonal qualities and make those awesome vids? Great, great personality. Thank you so much from Shavin. So interpersonal qualities, um, I think it was from sales. So I've actually been always in face-to-face uh, -face customer service helping since the age of 14. And now I've been doing sales for the past two years. You know, I just hit my target first in Australia this quarter as well. Um, sales are coming in, I'm doing really good with my sales. So are you single? Yes, I'm single. I've already answered that. Where are you from? I'm from Australia, Sydney, born and raised. I've had sex, but I want to be virgin boy like you. How can one do this? Uh, one can actually do this by, you know, for me, I'm the master of being virgin. So even when I have 15 kids, I'm still going to be a virgin because, you know, it's the master that remains virgin. So I don't think you can mimic this, unfortunately. So I don't have any advice for that. Want to exchange nudes? Hell yeah, I want to exchange nudes. From, okay, I won't say the name. I'm just joking. <laughs> no exchanging. Mum, mum, mum. No, 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 no. Proud to use your own face. I don't use much actually. So the two things are basically I use a face wash and I use a scrub, a facial scrub. 
and I use that pretty much every day. I try to use it every day, sometimes I forget. And when I leave the house, I make sure I put moisturizer. I feel like it gives so much more color. It's not color, but it like lightens your skin because it's dry when you sleep, you face wash at night or morning and your skin dries up. So make sure you moisturize. That's the biggest thing I could say. And I also do those two other things. Not much, not a question, just a comment. You have a big from a girl as well. So I don't know how she knows this, but <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Are you bisexual? No, I am not bisexual. I am straight as an arrow, but I have nothing against bisexual gays or whatever. You're all good. You're all cool. I've got a lot of friends that are gay and bisexual. So if you had the chance to say something, change something, what would it be and why? So since I was young, I always used to look at people with colored eyes and I wish I had green eyes or like hazel. Honestly, like I, I used to honestly go up to people in shopping centers and like these you know, anyone and I used to say you have really nice eyes and they used to look at me like what and they used to really like it though because if you can compliment someone why the hell not make sure you compliment someone if you think it's good not in a creepy way not like oh very nice eyes want to do something literally I used to say you have very nice eyes just wanted to say that you are doing porn movie um this looks like the casting couch so hell yeah I'm doing a porn movie <laughs> jokes I'm not doing porn movie no one knows me yet so that's my first family no I'm not can I have your number please? Hell no you can Mohammed. That's actually my friend asking for who actually has my number. So, <laughs> How old are you? Where is your family from in Pakistan? So basically my mum is from Karachi. My dad, we don't live with him and I haven't seen him for a while. So I don't actually know where he is from Pakistan. Do I know Kurdistan? Yes, I do. I also know the Kurdistan, Kurdistani, Kurdish, Kurdish, sorry. The Kurdish girls are really good looking. And so, shout out to you girls out there. I do know Kurdistan. Have you visited India? A few people asked that, and I'm going to visit India. Um, there was an issue. I was supposed to go to India for work uh, towards the end of last year. My visa took three months to come in. The trip cost me almost ten thousand dollars. Well, work paid for it, and my trip. I ended up missing it. Why did I miss it? Because my visa took three months, and we booked it about a month and a half before. We thought the visa was going to come through, but because my background is Pakistan, I'm born in Australia. My family is from Pakistan, though. My mum and my dad. Whereas everyone else is from Australia. My whole family is born in Australia. And they said, because your parents and grandparents are born in Pakistan, uh, we have to do a full background check. I'll interview my boss from the CEO who runs a multi billion, I say billion, Australian billion dollars uh, company. But they, had, they were interviewing him for three hours saying, you know, what do you do? Why do you want it? Why are you going to sponsor him? This and that. So I ended up missing the trip $10,000 down the grade, no exchange or nothing. So that happened. Favorite city? My favorite city is somewhere in Europe. I haven't traveled much, but I would love to go to Europe. I would love to live in Europe, move to Europe or um, America. But favorite city would be in Europe. The, it's just every photo I see it just looks beautiful. I saw a place called Carpi, I think it is in Italy. And that looked nuts. Obviously photos look better, but holy crap. Those places make me go, oh my God, I need to travel. So somewhere in Europe, I definitely want to move to either America or Europe very soon as well. When you are feeling though, which things boost you the most? I love questions like this, anything with motivation or working hard, whatever it is, this is a good question. So thank you so much. When I'm feeling low, I generally, as weird as it sounds, I generally don't feel low. So a lot of people that I sell to, like I said, I work and I sell medicine, I you know, visit other people. Generally, I don't feel down to be honest. And the reason is because before anything happens, I try to just counteract that and I stop thinking about anything. I do stop thinking about anything before stress comes. I try not to stress at all. So for example, just last week, I'm, I have two cars. One is a Mercedes, the other one's a Volkswagen. The Volkswagen I was gonna sell because it's just sitting there and I don't really use it. I was using it and he actually scraped the side and I was supposed to sell it this week. It was brand new, clean, no scratches, no crash, no nothing. And I was gonna sell it for a good price. He called me up, he said, hey man, I had a crash. Uh, I had scraped the whole side and this and that happened and I said don't worry about it what can we do all good because see like in that situation you would get angry you're like you know just a $30,000 car you know this and that and I said the, how, what what is anger going to do it's not going to change anything so there's no point in getting stressed or thing you deal with anything that comes and you stay happy and you go okay all good it happens so what trust me you should try to have that mindset because I feel like a lot of people they go into like depression and stuff like that because they keep this vicious cycle. What's going on? What's going to happen? What's going to happen? And then they go just downhill. So that's uh, who's your favorite actress in India? 
For me personally, I know there's a lot of Katrina Kaif fans. I really like her, I used to always like it. At the moment, I'd say Deepika Padgettone. She's been my favorite actor for like a year or two. It's just the way, the role she takes, if she fits it. I feel like that's her personality in real life. Now, I'm not sure, you always see acting in real life, there's someone different, that's how good they are acting. But it just feels like these, all these nice roles she takes, all these sweet roles, you know. Uh, she molds to the character so well, it looks like that's actually her side. So whenever I see her in, on film, she takes very similar roles and I feel like that's her in real life. The minute she comes, she's like, piss off! And I'm like, oh well, <laughs> I didn't expect that because she's a good actor. So I don't know, but Deepika's really good at the moment for me personally. I hope I haven't offended anyone, but Katrina Taff, I really like her as well. She's a good actress. What's your age and height? Um, and did I ever come to India or will I ever come to India? My age and height, I'm 23 years old. My height, like uh, it's about 182 centimeters, roughly. I'm not 100% sure. I haven't checked officially or anything like that, but around 181, 182 centimeters. So whatever that is, and um, already answered the Hindi, uh, India question. Do you understand Hindi? G ma Hindi samajhta hu, bol bhi sakta hu thoda sa. Itna acha nahi mere paas. People say I sound like an idiot when I speak, but you know what can you do? So G, mujhe Hindi pata hai. Hindi bol sakta hu, aur maine ek ya do video banaye thi. Main Hindi Hindi mein reaction kar raha tha. Jo pehli do ya teen thi. So wo dekh lo. Except YouTube videos, what else do you do? I do a whole bunch of things. I actually, I work full time, so I sell medicine. I'm a pharmaceutical sales rep. I've been doing that for two years. I was doing real estate before that. Um, I've got a medical science degree, so it got me straight into pharmaceutical sales when I graduated. I also, on the weekends, I do some shifts where I work undercover in, the oh my God, I shouldn't be saying that, but I do some undercover work somewhere, basically on the weekends, sometimes for extra cash. I also fix phones on the side when people call me up and say, hey, so can you fix an iPhone? So I fix the screen, I change the whole thing, which you might have seen on Instagram or some of my, um, one of the videos I put up as well, it has that in it. Um, I do a whole bunch of things, honestly, anything that can make me money. I'm really into the whole business and investing side of things. So I want to make sure I get as much money as quick as possible so I can put it towards something. It's not about running behind money. It's about, you know, I've got business goals and investment opportunities I want to take up before I get older so that is that I hope you guys understood a little bit about me I hope you guys liked this sorry for making it so long um, if you guys like you know these challenges let me know in the uh, comment section below I'd really appreciate it because I had a lot of fun so I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna be doing more challenge videos also like if you like this video let me know if you watched the whole video comment below say i watched the whole video because it's a really long one i've never done it so let me know if you actually watched the whole video and if you're new subscribe i hope you like this channel i hope uh, you know i sort of gave you an insight about who i am and guys honestly i appreciate all of these we were just at 1000 when we were supposed to make this video we got to 1700 just two days later so this is a 1000 subscriber special but we're almost at 2000 so I'm sorry for the two day delay, but I didn't know it was going to be so fast. So, thank you for all your support. This is your boy, Asa Amani. Thank you so much, guys. I will see you in the next video. Woo!